Hi Virgo, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Do know that you can go over to the website, book your own reading there. You can also ask a question or two and to the number below by texting your question to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link. All right, so let's get into it, Virgo. Thank you, Lord God, for blessing Virgo with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so Virgo, off camera, it looks like um, you've been loyal, dedicated, committed to a person, a relationship. Um, there's been a, a, you know, maybe no progression there, though. There's been no progression in terms of what the connection is, maybe even in title, you know, are we boyfriend and girlfriend? Are we going to get engaged? Well, you know, um, it just seems as if you might be over it. And maybe this was all just a big missed opportunity. This person didn't see your value or vice versa. This is you, Virgo. I don't know where you are in this. It might not be opportunity for reconciliation because someone is unwilling to budge to negotiate to compromise there's a power struggle within the two of you therefore there's no common ground or there's no mediation or there's no middle ground or no middle road it's just my way or the highway it's the both of you are like that you know and somebody's tired of compromising and conceding All right, so let's see. Let's see what's going on for Virgo. What do you have to tell Virgo, Lord? God? What do you have to tell Virgo? The Eight of Wands. All right, so there needs to be some clearing of the air. Somebody wants to know about someone's intentions here. What do you intend to do? What What is this about? You also need to be aware of the law of attraction i mean you attracted this person into your life for whatever reason this is happening for whatever reason uh you need to go through the emotions here also you need to have conversation even if it is um not face to face there needs to be conversation about maybe the trouble the jealousy within this connection there needs to be a clearing of the air uh, it looks like there's been a lot of emotions uh harbored just left with inside somebody's harboring a lot of emotions and not really speaking on them the chariot someone wants to know are we taking this this also could be travel too you know someone could be traveling together or moving or someone wants to know are we moving in together are we coming together um or is there still a, a high level of individuality and independence um is this relationship coming together? Are we staying together? There could have been conversations while you were on travel or while you were, while, while you were traveling, while you were on vacation. The Wheel of Fortune, yeah, maybe there could have been some change uh, in your fortune in, in terms of what is what was fated to happen. Uh, maybe things will turn out for the best here. Somebody feels like this person is their soulmate, therefore they just they're very, having a very hard time leaving the idea of this connection behind but they're also having a hard time getting in control and moving it forward into a new positive direction there's also someone wanting to know is that what we're doing are we moving it for yeah this also could have just been um with the will of fortune and then the devil coming out uh, playfulness a lot of playfulness Maybe even a lot of playfulness, good sex, good, you know, um, good drink, drugs. I don't know. Um, this isn't real. So somebody thought the relationship was moving in, in the right direction, but it's not exactly real. Um, this is someone keeping the other person tied and bound by way of carnal emotional f flesh uh you know like um just doing things together having sex having good drink 
sharing, exchanging, um, but something not being realized here. Right. And as it's not realized, here comes, this is my Virgo card, Virgo woman. Here comes the queen of swords wanting to know, well, what are we? What are we doing? Where's this going? If this is not real, then I can easily cut this out um, and get what is uh, due to me. You could be dealing with a Libra, Capricorn, Cancer, Sagittarius, Pisces, anybody here. Um, but yeah, you're at a place of just wanting to know, like, are you going to do the right thing? Is there going to be more balance? Uh, yes, we had a good time on vacation, on holiday for my birthday is what I'm hearing. Um, but at the same time, uh, what is really changing here? What is the change? If any. Okay. So that's what I have for you. Yeah. The world card. It's like somebody feels like they need to need to learn the lesson, wrap this up and move on. Okay. Because nothing is changing and someone is wanting the truth of the matter. Is this really, you know, are we really going to do this? Are we really going to be in a real relationship? Are we going to have that status change? Are you going to do the right thing? Are we getting married? Are we getting engaged? Are you going to get rid of that third party? Are you, once again, are you going to bring restore balance, harmony back into our connection? Are you going to make the decision here, cut something or someone out? Are we really going to take things to the next level in our connection? Are we, are we can we see this through is what someone is asking with the world card. So that's what I have for you, Virgo. If it resonates for you, please go over to the website, book your own reading there. Take advantage of the text question where you can text the question to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link. Thank you, Virgo. Many blessings to you. Take care.